Artificial intelligence, AI, is one of the biggest tech topics of 2016. This time around, it's Amazon.com hiring an AI expert to keep its web services business as a premier leader in the cloud storage and computing space. So, joining me now to talk all about this is Adam Zuckerman. Mm -hmm. He's the founder of Fosterly. So, Adam, Amazon just hired artificial intelligence expert mm -hmm. Alex Smola to work in its web services division. Is this a good hire? What can Smola bring to the table? And just who is this guy? Absolutely fantastic hire. He's one of the leading researchers in the space. Used to be at Google, then went over to Carnegie Mellon. And the pickup shows that there is an increasing desire by Microsoft, by Amazon, by Facebook, by Google to get into this space, the machine learning AI space, in a way that has the potential to really impact their businesses. I mean, you talk about this idea that virtual reality was a huge kind of frontier for a lot of these companies. Now it seems mm -hmm. like artificial intelligence is all the rage. Mm -hmm. So how do artificial intelligence, AI, and cloud storage and computing correlate? How do they match up? AI is basically, like you said, machine learning. Cloud mm -hmm. storage is basically data centers and storing stuff up so you can access it on a scalable basis. How can one business impact the other or work with each other? If you draw a parallel to a car, the outside may look pretty, but the question is what's under the hood. And what AI does is it's the engine for the car that they're driving. And it's not only for what they're building, so if you look at Facebook and they've got their face matching algorithms, that's built on AI, it's built on machine learning. This technology is the engine that helps them build all their products and helps the companies that are using their web service offerings build on their products as well. All right, so how is this AI race going? Because that's in essence what it is. You, you talked about it, mega cap technology companies are all over the mm -hmm. place. You got your Alphabet slash Google, Microsoft, mm -hmm. Apple, now Amazon, everybody else in it. Who's on top, who's leading the race right now and why? They're all winning and they're all losing. So if you look at Facebook, they've got your data, they've got your photos. If you look at Google, they've got the largest data set out there. If you look at Apple, they've got a closed ecosystem with devices that they really control. So they're each positioned to do very, very different things. What I can say is that the market is unbelievably competitive. Google announced earlier this morning that they're opening up a machine learning research group in Zurich, Switzerland, which is their largest non-US based engineering facility. And if you go to Smola's LinkedIn page, it's actually kind of funny. So many people are responding him, or, or reaching out to him rather, recruiting uh, to try and get him to work for them that he has a fill in the blank response saying, dear recruiter from X company, I'm not interested, I can't help you, and I'm not making intros to other people at Google for you. That, it's, it's fantastic. It just shows you how much demand there is for this kind of thing. Yeah. Get, get, one last question here. Mm -hmm. Put on your speculative hat. Venture a guess for us here. Mm -hmm. You talk about these, all these companies we mentioned, the Facebooks, the Googles, the you know, Amazons, the Microsofts, and everybody else out there. These are tech companies with billions and billions and billions of dollars in balance mm -hmm. sheet help. So in five or 10 years, who is leading the race then? It, it depends how you slice the pie. It's not just who's going to be leading, and obviously Google and Facebook and, and Amazon are the, are the three big fish, but it's what they're going to empower. If you look at what Robert Scoble live streamed this morning, he was meeting with a company in Europe called Digital Bridge, and they're helping consumers place virtual objects around the room. So I want to change my wallpaper over here, or I want to see what this picture looks like over there. It's the ecosystem that other people can build upon that's really going to be the, di the differentiator going forward. And AWS AWS specifically bringing on Smola positions them to empower so many other companies to build amazing things. All right, so it's all about that artificial intelligence ecosystem, mm -hmm. so to speak, exactly. going forward. Adam Zuckerman, thank you so much for joining us. That's Adam Zuckerman. He's the founder of Fosterly, mm -hmm. and thanks for watching. I'm Dominic Chu. Have a great day. Hey, CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the I right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.